when the sea force really comes in handy when you got a lot of trees we had a couple dead trees I had to cut down so now it's the cleanup time what happened is uh, not last year but the previous two years the gypsy moth caterpillars came in and they just really bad in this area and they ate all the leaves off the trees um, and some of the oaks didn't come back like this one here they just took down it didn't come back it completely died out there's one over there that completely died out there's some smaller ones around over here that did didn't make it either so anyways yeah I'm using the sea forest here to take loads of firewood over down to my woodshed and then I'm gonna split it all down there then I got to clean up all the crap and then we got another spot over here I'll show you where we knocked down an even bigger tree than this one and uh, it's going to uh, be a big job to clean it up as well so I don't know if you've seen my video that I just recently did where it's called go take me to the river and I just shot a quick three minute video of playing in the river and some scenery that sort of thing I love doing stuff like that and I'm actually this morning I started thinking about it how much I enjoyed making that video and I made another one not too long ago called trails and coffee around about the same idea of video I know not it's not everybody's cup of tea but I really enjoy that and I'm thinking I might create a separate YouTube channel just for videos like that because eventually I want to do longer form videos like 20 30 minutes of videos like that and I want to get a well first of all I got to get a better camera well I got my phone I, I, I refuse to get a big camera I want to use my phone so I think if I get my Samsung or a Samsung S22 Ultra or something like that they're supposed to have a really amazing camera on them I'm going to get um, what do you call it, a gimbal for phones and that'll really smooth things out smooth out the film and I'll be able to take some really good videos with that camera and a gimbal there'll be no like little shaking or nothing so I really like that sort of thing I've been watching other videos or other channels throughout the last couple of years and they make videos like that not with ATVs or anything just like um, uh, like off-grid movies or there's a really good channel called trout and coffee if you like scenery and cool stuff like that like he has an old Volkswagen van and he works on his cabins and stuff like that and he does a lot of narrating on his videos too he actually has a room just for narrating that's soundproof and when he's on the road he has this booth he bought and he can just fit in there and he can narrate so it's pretty cool just awesome way to you, you see things different you see like he makes quick quick cuts quick video cuts quick clips I mean just quick clips and it keeps people's interest but it's all like you know just flowers blowing around and rivers and creeks and lakes and animals and just very cool stuff I like that sort of thing so I'm thinking I'm going to create a separate channel and put videos like that but it's all going to be also be ATV and side by side related just my adventures out in the, in the wild here in the nature if that's something you'd be interested in I'm gonna do it anyway but if that's something you'd be interested in just leave a comment below let me know what your thoughts are on that we're gonna to have to come up with a name for that channel I'm not sure so if anybody's got any suggestions on um, what we can name that channel like I said I just thought of it today and I think I'm going to do it just as a separate thing and uh, if you got any names for that channels that channel let me know down below give me some examples see what we can come up with